because I've used Chromebooks before, I felt as though, oh my God, I'm getting my own. Um, this is actually going to be mine f for school. And it, I felt like school is giving me this, they're giving me something. And I, f I felt so happy because school gives you opportunities, but they've never give you something so physical like a Chromebook. Since coming to the Academy, uh, we, we've made massive changes, in particular changing the culture and ethos of the school. We got together and talked about our options and based on the research that we did, the best option for us was looking at Chromebooks as the solution in, in school. And we looked at various models for that, but eventually we decided that going one-to-one -one with Chromebooks would be the best way to impact on the student experience for our learners here in school. We then went and pitched that to the whole senior leadership team and then subsequently went to the governing body and, and had a conversation with them about where we would like to move things forward. Mark approached us around about uh, a year ago and came along to the governing body and gave us a, an outline of, um, really it was a vision of what the future might be with the Chromebooks. Well, it was very important that we sold the idea to parents and carers first and we, we ran some sessions where we introduced them all to the idea, talked to them about the opportunities for their children. Our parents are happy, they think this is good. Yeah, it's very good. Mm. As, as the idea of going like one-to-one -one and every student having a device and every member of staff having a device was a, a huge kind of cultural shift in the school. So that change management process was really, really important. So it was about making staff feel confident and comfortable and capable of being able to use uh, this, this technology. I think the feedback from, from parents we've had so far is that they are very positive indeed. They are delighted that the school has been prepared to invest in that resource for, for their children. So on your Chromebooks, you are going to design a treasure map. So by adopting our, our new initiative, it's been a perfect vehicle to start delivering that next stage. We sort of adopted a little and often training approach, so rather than sort of bombarding them with lots of change all at once, we started the process in September and gradually built towards going live in the sort of April times. And then once we'd kind of got staff up to a certain technical level, we then really focused on, right, now you know how to share a document. How are you going to use sharing to impact on the learning for the students in your lessons? What can you use this for to mean that your students are making rapid progress? I try to incorporate uh, some kind of uh, Google activity um, every lesson, so they're using the, the Acer Chromebooks on a regular basis. It's part of the equipment for language learning. Um, obviously in languages you've got your different skills, your reading, your writing, um, your listening and your speaking, and we can use all of those with the Acer Chromebooks. Colleagues are telling me that the pace at which they can deliver is increasing because things can be managed much more quickly. The children are taking their Chromebooks out of the lesson and you see them finishing homework, doing research in their own time before school or in the canteen at break time. And it has been an absolutely massive difference over the last few weeks. We've yet to release so much of the potential, but the start we've made has been absolutely fantastic. The biggest benefit of the rollout so far has to be the way the students have become independent learners. In the past, students would only have paper resources and they would either have the teacher speaking and have these paper resources and that's all they could use. Now they have the internet and their ability to actually go and find an answer for themselves and take advantage and kind of um, ownership of their own learning. It gives students access to the best quality resources, it allows them to collaborate and work together and it lets them kind of really extend their learning outside of the classroom. The children are engaged, teachers can try and do things with you know, new apps through a different medium. The collaboration means you can get small groups of children all collaborating on a single document. And to see those changes appearing right in front of their eyes, that immediately hooks them in. So perhaps on this team, Mehdi, you start with the agree, Tyab, you start on the disagree. I think ultimately the school's vision is to become an outstanding school uh, and we see the ICT that we have in school as the bedrock of, of outstanding teaching and learning. We knew we had to get some, some teachers alongside developing their skills. So an, another piece of Mark's vision was to set up some Google Champions, a staff group who would lead the learning of colleagues and a Google Champion student group. 
the name has become a bit of a gimmick in our school now that we're walking around oh he's a champion go ask him or a champion's entering the class let's applaud him it's just really made us more aware of our leadership role within the school and our responsibility to be better learners just not for ourselves but for everyone around us for me as a school we sort of have a, a moral duty to provide the best possible resource that we can for our students uh, and i was very clear when I, we gave the device to the students that you know they're very lucky to have this, but equally I think it's our, it's our job to provide that for you. And it exhibits a certain amount of trust in them to have this responsibility, not just of having access to all this information, but having access to a device and being responsible for it. Uh, and I think they've completely sort of repaid that trust in the way that they've been enthusiastic. So the, kind of the level of, kind of, of engagement from the students has been absolutely phenomenal. You know, being one of the first schools to take this on as a total ICT solution and to be upfront there, it makes me feel immensely proud. Proud that the, you know, of Mark and Terry with those initial ideas, but to the way everybody has absolutely embraced it to make it an ordinary piece of day-to-day -day school life. I think it makes me feel really really proud to see the students engaged in their learning and to sort of see that kind of level of positivity in school. I just I have a real sense of like pride and satisfaction and I sort of use the word sort of moral duty but you know the reason that I got into working in education in the first place was to have that impact on on the students and their and their lives really so to see that happening in, in front of me every day is, is a really satisfying experience.